Welcome to our video on Hindenburg Research, a financial research and investigative firm that focuses on uncovering fraud and deception in publicly traded companies. Founded in 2011 by Nathan Anderson and Daniel Yu, the company has built a reputation for being a highly credible and reliable source of information on publicly traded companies. In this video, we will take a closer look at the history, activities, and power of Hindenburg Research, and how it helps to protect investors and other stakeholders in the financial industry. So, sit back and enjoy as we delve into the world of Hindenburg Research. Hindenburg Research's activities include conducting in-depth investigations into publicly traded companies, analyzing financial statements, and interviewing industry experts and former employees. The firm also uses various digital tools and techniques to uncover hidden information and evidence of fraud. One of the key powers of Hindenburg Research is its ability to gather and analyze large amounts of data in order to identify patterns and anomalies that may indicate fraud or deception. The firm also has a strong network of contacts in the financial industry, which allows them to gain access to information and sources that are not publicly available. Hindenburg Research has a reputation for being a highly credible and reliable source of information, and its findings have led to a number of high-profile cases of fraud and deception being exposed. Some notable examples include the uncovering of fraud at companies such as NMC Health and Luck and Coffee. Hindenburg Research also frequently releases research reports and articles on its website, HindenburgResearch.com, which provide detailed analysis of specific companies and industries. They also have a YouTube channel where they posted videos explaining their findings and research on certain companies, and also have a Twitter account where they share their findings and give live updates. Overall, Hindenburg Research is a valuable resource for investors and other stakeholders in the financial industry, as it helps to uncover and expose fraudulent and deceptive practices in publicly traded companies. Recently, a report from Hindenburg Research on Indian business tycoon Gautam Adani's business empire sparked a 51 billion US dollars sell-off in shares of his group companies, pushing him four places down on the World Billionaire Index. The report said that the Adani group had engaged in a brazen stock manipulation and accounting fraud scheme over the course of decades. The disclosure came just ahead of Adani Enterprises' 20,000 crore open offer of shares to investors. Adani Group has since rubbished the report as a malicious combination of selective misinformation and stale, baseless and discredited allegations. That, however, hasn't stopped investors from selling off. One controversy surrounding Hindenburg Research is the question of whether or not the firm's research is biased. Some critics argue that the company has a vested interest in uncovering fraud and deception in publicly traded companies, as it can benefit financially from short selling the stock or from consulting work. Additionally, some people have suggested that Hindenburg Research may not always have the full picture of a company's situation and that their conclusions are biased and not always well researched. Another controversy is that some of the companies targeted by Hindenburg Research have accused the firm of spreading false information and damaging their reputation. This has led to some legal action against the firm, with some of the targeted companies claiming that Hindenburg Research's findings are not based on fact, but on speculation and conjecture. It's worth noting that Hindenburg Research denies any bias or intent of spreading false information, and state that they back their research with facts and evidence. They also mention that they have a strict policy of not shorting or having any financial interest in the companies they research. It's important to note that controversies like these are not uncommon in the world of financial research, as opinions and perspectives on companies can vary widely. It's up to the individual to conduct their own research and make their own decisions about the credibility of Hindenburg Research and its findings. In conclusion, Hindenburg Research is a financial research and investigative firm that has made a name for itself in uncovering fraud and deception in publicly traded companies. While the company has a reputation for being credible and reliable, there have been some controversies surrounding its research methods and potential biases. It's important to note that when it comes to financial research and analysis, different perspectives and opinions are to be expected. It's up to the individual to conduct their own research, fact-checking and make their own decisions about the credibility of the research and its findings. Thank you for watching our video on Hindenburg Research. We hope that you have a better understanding of the company's history, activities, and power, and how it helps to protect investors and other stakeholders in the financial industry.